Hi guys! In today's tutorial, we are going to make an amigurumi sailor moon. So if you want to know how I did this, please keep on watching. Happy hooking! The materials that we need are the following. Red, white, black, dark blue, skin tone, and yellow cotton yarn. These are all cotton yarn. You can also use acrylic yarn if you want to. Scissor. Toy stuffing. We will use 3mm crochet hook. Needle safety pin as my stitch marker safety eyes for the doll small and this is also optional pipe cleaner so guys without further ado let's get started first get your skin tone the yarn and then your three millimeter crochet hook and then we will make a magic ring. And then chain off one. Now we will make six single crochet inside the ring. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Now Pull the tail to close the circle. Now we are done with round one. And then place your stitch marker. So we will make a continuous round. No need to add a slip stitch. Now for round two, we are going to make an increase in each stitch. Increase means two single crochet in every stitch one two so we will make increase all the way around so at the end of the round we should have 12 single crochet now round three we are going to make one single crochet in the first stitch and then in the next stitch increase So in this round, round three, our pattern will be one increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 18 single crochet. Now, round four, two, I mean round four, one single crochet in the next two stitches. One. and on in the third stitch we are going to make an increase so 
So in this round, round 4, our pattern will be to increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 24 single crochet. Now, round 5, we will make one single crochet in the next 3 stitches. One, two, and three. And then in the fourth stitch, we are going to make an increase. So in this round, round five, our pattern will be three increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 30 single crochet. Now, round six, one single crochet in the next four stitches. One. Two three four and then in the fifth stitch we are going to make an increase. So in this round, round six, our pattern will be four increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 36 single crochet. Now, round seven, we will make one single crochet in the next five stitches. One. two three four and five and then in the sixth stitch we are going to make an increase So in this round, round 7, our pattern will be 5 increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 42 single crochet. Now guys, we are done increasing. So next round, round 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12, we will make single crochet all the way around for 5 rounds. So at the end of the round, we still have 42 single crochet. So guys, I'll get back to you once I'm done with my 5 rounds of single crochet. Now, we are done with our 5 rounds of single crochet. So next round, round 13, we will make 1 single crochet in the next 5 stitches. One, two, three, four, and five. Now, we will make invisible decrease in the next two stitches. So you can also use the normal decrease if you want to. The traditional decrease. So 
So in this round, round 13, our pattern will be 5 degrees all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 36 single crochet. Now, round 14, we will make one single crochet in the next 4 stitches. One, two, three, and four. And now invisible decrease in the next two stitches. So in this round, round 14, our pattern will be 4 degrees all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 30 single crochet. Now, round 15, we will make one single crochet in the next 3 stitches. 1, 2 and 3. Now invisible decrease in the next 2 stitches. So in this round, round 15, our pattern will be 3 in 3 decrease all the way around so at the end of the round we should have 24 single crochet and guys i will also add toy stuffing off cam okay now round 16 we will make one single crochet in the next two stitches one two and then invisible decrease in the next two stitches so in this round round 16 our pattern will be two decrease all the way around so at the end of the round we should have 18 single crochet now round 17 one single crochet in the first stitch oops And then invisible decrease in the next two stitches. One, two. So in this round, round 17, our pattern will be one decrease all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 12 single crochet. Now we are done decreasing and adding the tie stuffing. So next round, round 18, 19, and 20, we will make single crochet all the way around for three rounds. So guys, I'll get back to you once I'm done with my three rounds of single crochet. This will be served as the neck of our doll. So at the end of the round, we still have 12 single crochet. Now guys, we are at the last stitch. So next step, we are going to change yarns to white yarn. That's how I change my yarns. 
and then don't forget to place your stitch marker at the last stitch now round 21 we will make one single crochet in the first stitch Oops. so we will be working using the white yarn again one single crochet in the first stitch oops sorry and then in the next stitch increase So in this round, round 21, our pattern will be one increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 18 single crochet. And now we can cut the skin toned yarn. Okay. Now round 22 we will make one single crochet in the next two stitches one two and in the third stitch we are going to make an increase So in this round, round 22, our pattern will be to increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 24 single crochet. Now, round 23, we are going to make one single crochet in the next three stitches. One. two and three and then in the fourth stitch we are going to make an increase oops sorry in the third in the ah uh, yeah in the third fourth stitch increase So in this round, round 23, our pattern will be 3 increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 30 single crochet. Now, round 24, we will make 4 single crochet. Yeah. I mean, we will make 1 single crochet in the next 4 stitches one two three and four and in the fifth stitch invisible i mean increase again fifth stitch increase so in this round, round 24, our pattern will be 4 increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 36 single crochet. Now, we are done increasing. So next round or next step, we are going to make the arm partition. So we will fold our work, we will fold our work like this. And then get your stitch marker. So first, as you can see, there's the increase. So we will count this. One, two, three, four, five, 
6, 7, and 8. So as you can see, there's an increase again. So we will place our stitch marker. It should be 8 stitches for the arms. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then on the other arms, get your stitch marker again so we will count here as you can see the increase again so place your stitch marker in the first increase so one two three four five six seven and eight so we will remove this other stitch marker and then place the other stitch marker in the last increase there so now we have the uh, arm partitions so it should be eight stitches in both arms okay so now we are going to make the body so let's check if we have 20 stitches for round 25, 25, 26, 27, 28, and 29, we will make single crochet all the way around for 5 rounds. So 1, 2, so we should have 20 single crochet. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20 so we will add four more rounds of single crochet to complete the five rounds and then don't forget to place your stitch marker at the last stitch okay so guys i'll get back to you once i'm done with my four rounds of single crochet plus one round so total five rounds okay now guys we are done with our five rounds of single crochet so next round round 30 we are going to make single crochet all the way around working in the back loop only so we will work here back loop so this is the front loop and this is the back loop so we will make single crochet all the way around working in the back loop only
So at the end of the round, we still have 36 single crochet. Okay? Again, back loop only. And then I will also add toy stuffing of cam. So guys, I'll get back to you once I'm done with this round. So now guys, we are at the end of the round. So next step, we are going to change yarn again to the skin toned yarn. And then place your stitch marker at the last stitch. Now, we are going to make the leg partition. So as you can remember, we have 20 stitches. So we will be divided into two. So in both legs, we should have 10 stitches. So first, stitch here. One, two, three, four. Five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then place your stitch marker again. So we have 10 single crochet in the first leg. So let's see if we also have 10 stitches here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, they are both equal. So, guys, we will make 15 rounds of single crochet since we started already the first round. So, we will make 14 more rounds of single crochet for the legs. Okay, so, guys. I'll get back to you once I'm done with my 15 rounds of single crochet for the legs. So I will make, I will do the same thing on the other legs, okay? And then I will let you know for the next step. Now, we are done with our 15 rounds of single crochet. So next, we are going to use the black yarn. This serves as the shoes of our doll so first insert our hook here in the second last two stitches <clears throat> excuse me and then 
chain of one and then single crochet in the same stitch chain one is not considered in the count so first single crochet and then second here and then next here so we will make three rounds of single crochet using the black yarn again three rounds so at the end of the round we still have 10 single crochet so guys i'll get back to you once i'm done with my three rounds of single crochet i will also do the same thing on the other legs okay now we are done with our three rounds of single crochet so next we are going to add the pipe cleaner this is optional you can also use toy stuffing or wire if you have So I will just fold the two pipe cleaner. And then insert. Oops. And then get your needle. So we will just sew the hole just in and out in and out to close the hole And then insert at the center and then here and then fasten off cut the excess now we are done with the legs so next step the arms so we are going to use the skin toned yarn remove your stitch marker and then insert in the first stitch here first stitch and then oops and then chain off one Chain of one is not included in the count. So we will make single crochet in the same stitch. So 
So we will make single crochet all the way around. So we should have eight single crochet. So we will make 12 rounds of single crochet for both arms. So guys, I'll get back to you once I'm done with my 12 rounds of single crochet. Now guys, we are done with our 12 rounds of single crochet. So next step, we will add the pipe cleaner. Same as what we did for the legs earlier. So we will fold our pipe cleaner like that. And then insert. If you have wires or, or toy stuffing, you can also do so. And then get your needle and then insert in and out, in and out. And then insert at the center. And then Cut the excess. Now, now we will make the skirt. So get your dark blue yarn. And then insert your hook where the front loop is here front loop so in round one we will work in the front loop only for the skirt so get your dark blue yarn And then chain off two. One, two. Chain two doesn't include in the count. So we just add chain two so that later when we slip stitch, it doesn't have a big hole. Okay. So first we will make double crochet in the same stitch. One double crochet and then in the next stitch or in the next front loop we will make an increase double crochet increase
So in this round, round one for the skirt, our pattern will be one increase all the way around. Okay? So guys, I'll get back to you once I'm done with round one for the skirt. Now, we are done with round one. So in total, for round one, we should have 30 double crochet. And then slip stitch with the, at the top of the double crochet, the first double crochet. And then again, two chains. Again, two chains is not considered in the count. As you can see, there's no big hole between the slip stitch. So that's why I add two chains. And then next, we will make one double crochet in the next two stitches. So first double crochet here in the same stitch. One. And then on the next stitch, one double crochet. And then on the third stitch, we will make an increase. So in this round, Round two, our pattern will be two increase all the way around. So for round two, our total double crochet will be 40. Again, round two, our pattern will be two increase all the way around. So at the end of the round, we should have 40 double crochet. Now, round three, we will make, again, chain two, not consider in the count, and then double crochet all the way around. So at the end of the round, we still have 40 double crochet. And then slip stitch at the last stitch, and then fasten off. So guys, I'll get back to you once I'm done with this round. And for the next step. Okay. I made this off cam. So what I did was I made a chain of 10 and then single crochet from the second chain of the hook. And then single crochet, crochet in the entire row. So we should have nine single crochet and then I made four rows of this and then now I'm going to sew this at the center to make it ribbon like this. So one, two, three, four, five. I will insert my hook in the fifth single crochet same goes at the top one two three four five and then we will make a knot here So it's like a ribbon, like that.
and then we are going to sew this in our doll like that oops sorry So now we are done with the ribbon. So next will be the hair. So I have, I already made the hair off cam. It's the same pattern as what we have started for the hair. I mean for the head. So first magic ring and then six single crochet inside the ring and then round two increase round three one increase round four two increase round five three increase round six four increase and round seven five increase and then single crochet all the way around so it's up to you if you want to increase or decrease the round so but in this hair i made only six rounds of single crochet and then in the first stitch i made a slip stitch and then 40 single crochet i mean 40 double crochet and then in the last stitch slip stitch again and then fasten off and then also for the bun i made magic ring and then six single crochet inside the ring and then round two increase and then two rounds of single crochet so i made i made two so all the pattern i will put in the description box okay so now what we're going to do is we are going to sew the hair 
like that and then So guys, I will just sew this off thumb and then I'll get back to you for the next step. Now guys, we are done sewing the bun. So this is what we use for sewing. And now next step, we are going to add the strands of the hair here in the bun, on the bun. There. Get your hook or your needle, it's easier. And then insert here. like that so it's up to you how many strands do you want to add So guys, I'll do the rest of the hair of cam, and then I will also add the face of cam, and then I'll get back to you for the final look, okay? Now guys, here is the final look of our Amigurumi Sailor Moon. It's very easy to make, guys. I hope you will give it a try. And if you find this video helpful, Please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And don't forget to click the bell button to be notified. Again, 
Thank you for watching, guys. Bye.